top 10 Makita tools that you didn't know existed. At number 10, we have the DCM501 18 volt LXT coffee maker. And at number nine, with the DKT360 36 volt or twin 18 volt LXT kettle. Now, we've bundled these entries together because they're probably both the most well known on this list. Also, they're somewhat similar and they're both lovely to have on site. If you're a Makita fan, you know, and you really want to show it, this is perfect. If we're talking the coffee maker, it takes 60 mil coffee pods, or if you're just looking for pure boiling water, then maybe the kettle is more your style. Instant noodles for lunch without any power about. Slap the batteries in this kettle and enjoy. At number eight, we have the DWD181 18 volt LXT wall scanner. Now, looking at it, it looks like something you probably scan your shopping with, but this is a very important tool when in the right hands. Now, you use this when trying to detect other materials within a wall, and so this is gonna be great at detecting the likes of pipes and live wires. Now, on this lovely display, uh, you have scene mode, which is gonna be great because you can choose between working on dry concrete, wet concrete, and there's also petition mode and radar view mode, so this is as versatile as possible. Another handy feature is that when in use, the device actually has a laser line, so you can make sure that it is being held up straight against the wall. Another nifty thing is that it is IP54 dust and drip proof, meaning that you can get precise and detailed scanning without worrying about the tool getting damaged. At number seven, we have the DVR350Z 18 volt LXT vibrating poker. Now, full disclosure, my purse has offered me 50 quid if I avoid all innuendos with this one. So, um, <clears throat> This device is used in wet concrete to remove any air bubbles from within the mix. This adds consistency and strength to the concrete. This thing is powerful too, providing 13,000 vibrations per minute from the 25 mil diameter shaft. You also have a handy two position trigger, which you can use to operate the tool regardless of how you're holding it. At number six, we have the HR006GZ 80 volt mats or twin 40 volt brushless demolition hammer. There is only one word to describe this, beast running off of not one but two 40 volt xgt batteries to give you <laughs> this thing gives off 21.4 joules of impact energy which isn't far from makita's most powerful corded demolition hammer of course this isn't something that everyone's going to want to have in their toolkit but regardless the hr006 gz will go through concrete like a hot knife through butter. At number five, we have the Makita six piece screwdriver set. Good luck slapping your battery in these. Makita actually have a range of hand tools that many people don't know about. This range covers the essentials like tape measures, ratchets, laser levels, and in this case, screwdrivers. This set includes Phillips, slotted, and posi drivers. And if you're a Makita fan and you like telling the world, then you're gonna wanna have these in your tool bag. At number four, we have the DHG181ZJ 18 volt LXT heat gun. Now this is a tool you're gonna see more on the automotive side of things. It can produce heat up to 550 degrees Celsius, which is perfect for cleaning off old paint, bending plastic piping, but most commonly applying wraps to cars. It even comes with a selection of nozzles so you can guide the airflow in different ways if you need to protect certain materials. And just a quick note, uh, I found this out after we started writing this script. Um, it has a paddle switch as well. So if you, you're similar to that of an angle grinder, you have to flip it down and then press the trigger in. At number three, we have the DCW180Z 18 volt LXT cool up warmer. If you find yourself working in the cold often, then a jacket is gonna be great for keeping you warm. But what about your luggage? This is a box that can warm up to 60 and cool as low as 18 degrees Celsius. There's a range of features here, including a trolley style handle, caster wheels, a bottle opener, and a USB port for charging your phone. Aside from being a handy addition on site, it is also great for the likes of family barbecues and camping. At number two, we have the DEAAD P05 18 volt USB charger. I mean, that code just rolls off the tongue. Instead of lugging around the massive cooler box to charge your phone, because that's silly, why not slap this adapter right onto your LXT battery? This has two USB ports, both outputting 2.1 amps from each port. And this can be an absolute lifesaver when you're on a job site without any power outlets. And it even has a belt clip so you can easily store it on you at all times. And at number one, we have the Makita MR009GZ 40 volt XGT radio lantern. You heard me right. This thing is both a radio and a lantern. Makita are known for their job site radios, but this takes it to the next level. This thing is perfect if you're working in low light environments and even if you're going camping or fishing. It has an impressively bright sight light that can be operated like a lantern or even as a torch. 
but the radio is as equally impressive, being able to connect to AM, FM, DAB Plus and Bluetooth so you can stream the tunes directly from your phone. So there we have it, the 10 crazy inventions from Makita that you might not know about. Please comment below if there are any more that you think we missed and as always find all of these tools in the Makita Superstore over at ITS.co.uk.